miss two of their three at this point. Ajani Teeler picks up where she left off last week from the right side. Full setter, but not a real presence on the block, and Skinner just goes over the top of her. Ace for Madison Lilly, the SEC setter and player of the week, Kentucky All-American. Kentucky defense comes through on the right side. Lilly, after all that bragging. The Wildcats with a one-point lead. Avery Skinner cuts it right through the Ole Miss defense. That's wide, and the Wildcats take it 25-21, and they come back to win set number one. There's that jump serve again. Gabby Curry receives. And there's Allie Stumler. Just a jackknife of a shot. Outside hitters, so neither one of their outside hitters play in the back row, but that's indicative of a team with a lot of young players. Great. Overall, college learned skills that these freshmen at Ole Miss will learn under Caleb Banworth. What great defensive play by Gabby Curry, and it pays off for Avery Skinner. When you can sky like that at 6'2", coach, and you're Texas a &M. But a little too excited on that serve, and the Wildcats win it. 25 to 17 to take a 2 0 lead. Question is, how do you hit it down enough to keep it in play but not get blocked? And she'll learn. Avery Skinner again. Give her eight kills. And the defense comes through again for the Wildcats. Bug to serve. Quick attack by Madison Lilly. Knows just when to do it. Last year at Ohio State, but. Another ace for the Wildcats. Lilly's on a roll. Now Kendall Paris, so to Florida. Wow, the dig by Curry. Nobody can do that, what Madison Lilly just did. Her off Allie Stone. Nice dig by Ryan Walker, and it leads to the kill once again by one of the Skinner sisters. Take your pick this time. Five foot five, but they're all ace passers. And when you've got a Johnny Taylor in front of you, you can deliver. Bear just rolls it. Off the hands of the Rebels, Kendall Paris puts it away for the Wildcats. And they take set number three, 25 to 11. Another sweep for the third-ranked Wildcats. Three's